good morning uh, today uh, welcome to uh, Luke chapter 1 verses uh, 26 through 38 entitled Christ birth announced to Mary and uh, also welcome to unique devotion let's get started now, in the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent by God to a city of Galilee named Nazareth to a virgin betrothed to a man whose name was Joseph and of the house of David. The virgin's name was Mary. And having come in, the angel said to her, Rejoice, highly favored one, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. But when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying and considered what manner of greeting this was. Then the angel said to her, Do not be afraid. Mary, you have found favor with God. And behold, you will conceive in your womb and bring forth a son, and shall call his name Jesus. He will be great, and will be called the Son of the Highest, and the Lord will give him the throne of his father David, and he will reign over the house of Jacob forever. And of his kingdom there will be no end. Then Mary said to the angel, How can this be, since I do not know a man? And the angel answered and said to her, The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the highest will overshadow you. Therefore, also, that Holy One is to be born will be called the Son of God. Now, indeed, Elizabeth, your relative has also conceived a son in her old age, and this is now the sixth month for her who has call, been called barren, for with God nothing will be impossible. Then Mary said, Behold, the maid servant of the Lord, let it be to me according to your word, and the angel departed from her. Um, as always, there's a few things I think that kind of start to pop out here but the one that stands out the most is uh, verse 37 for with God nothing will be impossible um, I think the question he's asking me here is do I truly believe that with God all things are possible are there are there things in my life um, on a daily basis and I'll focus on this today that I feel like it can't be done or there's no answer no way around it no answer to the problem um, but it is possible there is an answer there is a way around the problem there's a always a way to fix it maybe not always the way we like but um, nevertheless there is always a way and um, so today I will focus on do I truly think that all things are possible with God? Um, hopefully that's a good question that helps uh, provoke you to think. Um, think over this, the whole verse, uh, the whole chapter part here from uh, 26 to 38 in the book of Luke chapter 1. And um, just see what kind of questions pop out at you. And maybe as the day goes on, a new question will pop up. Um, e either case... Uh, please leave those questions down in the comments below. That might help me or others um, to, to decipher through the day issues that they're having and come up with answers to life. Um, please like the video and uh, so it can get passed on to your friends and other people uh, can see that uh, it's here and available to use. And um, Okay, that's it. Just uh, have a good day today and enjoy. God bless.